everyone, today's video is my 17 week pregnancy update. I am just overwhelmed that I'm 17 weeks, like it's crazy, I'm almost halfway. It's blowing my mind how fast this time like, the pregnancy is going, which of course it's a good thing and a bad thing because it's, I am so excited to meet this little person, but I mean, and then you're scared too because you know the real work begins when the baby comes. So, um, but again, I can't wait to meet this little, this little person, this little little sweet pea, I just, I'm so excited. This week, a lot, of, a lot of new symptoms happening and let's get into it. First thing I want to say, if you hear any noises, that's Griffin and Sawyer playing. I say every week, but they make a lot of noise. They're getting older, and they're hooting, and they're talking, and they're playing. See? I talk to them. They get crazy loud. My first symptom this week is I've been losing a ton of hair. And again, like, never had this happen before. I know that usually most women gain hair, but I've lost... A lot. I mean, it's not like clump, not, there's no patches or anything, but I'm just, I'm shedding like crazy. And I know the weather has been kind of weird where we live, hot, cold kind of thing. And I know that from what I research, researched on, you know, Google, <laughs> which I know you're not supposed to, but I do anyway, that some women have hair loss during pregnancy. But and then I you wonder because of I got pregnant with like after the twins, and that because I didn't nurse with the twins, and I had the blood transfusion, that my body's a little, a little bit off whack. So I, mean, I believe that this pregnancy is gonna like heal me. I know it's kind of maybe sounds silly to most people, but I feel like I'm gonna be back into like hormonal normal. Like I'm gonna just be more balanced. I think I still feel a little bit like I can cry randomly, but I can get mad randomly sometimes. I think it's that hopefully I'll be able to nurse this baby. I'm gonna do every way power. Hopefully nothing bad happens. Nothing bad's gonna happen. Nothing. <laughs> okay? But, like, I just hope everything just goes smoothly and that I can nurse and my body can transition better instead of just being like, like, I mean, my body went to shock last time. I had a baby, had babies, and then no nursing, transfusion, and everything was off white. So this time, it's gonna be perfect. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> but yeah, so hair loss has been one of my biggest symptoms this week, which is, you know, fun and gross. You know, my hair, you know, just everywhere. Food cravings, which if you watched our uh, live Q&A, which we had so much fun doing, we love doing those. They're just so much fun to interact with you guys. Love it. Um, we talked about the food thing me and Will had. Like, he, he's, he likes weird food. I don't. But this pregnancy, I've been craving. Like, it's so weird. But um, barbecue potato chips with vanilla ice cream. Um, I, I did scoop it once. But like usually it's more like a separate thing. I take a bite of chip, spoonful of ice cream kind of thing. Tastes to me so good together. So good. Like it is, it's like, oh, like it's, I don't know why. It is so good. Love me some barbecue sauce. I love barbecue sauce on everything right now. It is, that's another craving, like barbecue. Like, mm, mm, mm. I'm not a big barbecue fan when I'm not pregnant. So craving for sure if the baby wants barbecue sauce. Another food thing, again, like I mentioned this almost every week, dairy is not sitting well, and I, I have, I can't stay away from it, <laughs> and I know I've had a lot of suggestions on like other substitutes, which I do, like I have, I have coffee mate for my coffee, when I can drink coffee, because coffee's still not sitting well, uh, I have almond milk for my cereal, when I have cereal, but like, there's nothing like a cup of coffee with some cream in it, oh, it's so good, it's how I drink my coffee usually, it's cream and coffee, it's so good, and Every time I drink that, I just feel like I'm gonna just lose it. So, I, yeah, but I keep, I keep making them stick. I keep doing it because it takes a little bit of going down. So, that's pretty much it for food cravings. Another, like, symptom this week, uh, which again, I'll be talking about after about next week, uh, spots in my eyes. Not like once the twins where it was constant, but I'm gonna definitely, it makes me concerned. And I will definitely be talking to her about it. When I got pregnant with Harrison, my eyesight changed. And um, I was I went to the eye doctor because I had blurry vision. They said I had a small stigmatism. I do have glasses. Um, but, I mean, it's just I can see everything. Just the far away vision is kind of blurry. And it is a symptom of pregnancy. It does get better after I... Um, give birth, not perfect by all means. I will need glasses one day full, always. I know I just, I am pushing as long as I can until it, you know, becomes that not actual big problem. So I wonder if it's part of the vision thing changing, the little spots I see. But yeah, I'll ask my doctor and see what she says. This week I have been feeling more awake, finally awake, like not, like I'm just so tired. Like usually I am, last like, I don't know, month. 
I've been exhausted. Like, and I, I really thought it was caffeine, but then now, like, yeah, I haven't had to drink more caffeine, and that's just like, you know, I can. It's not a lot because my body won't accept it. But I feel more awake overall. That's been nice. It's been nice for my kids. It's been nice for me. So awake, totally good. TMI for the next two things I'm talking about. Been a little more regular in the bathroom. I'm normally a constipated person uh, since I since the age of birth. Um, I just I just don't go every day usually. And um, this pregnancy, it's been more frequent, and it's been of course awesome. So that's fun. And then another thing, a uh, little more discharge. Um, well, actually, quite a bit discharge. Nothing to be concerned about. This more wear a liner all as well. All is well. All is well. Another thing that's been going on. Yeah, I have a lot today to say this week. I've been very hot, sweating. I feel hot. Like it's gotten cold here, like in the 30s, and I'm hot. Yeah, I'm wearing a sweatshirt right now. I know I shouldn't be, but I'm comfortable with sweatshirt. I live in sweatshirts usually all winter long, even fall, partly summer, because our summers never get hot here. I just like sweating sweatshirts. Um, and I'm really hot, like really, really hot, and it smells like. I'm like freezing and I'm like, I'm hot, I don't have a heater on, what are you doing? And he's like, I'm freezing, but no, heat has been a big thing. Um, peeing a lot, always, I think that's just now my norm, just peeing all the time, 24 <laughs> seven. It's just, ugh. it's annoying, it's annoying. The other thing is I'm not so hungry this, this week, which has been really good, like, I don't feel like I'm dying to eat all the time, like I need food in me, which is nice. My hormones, I feel a little bit of a little bit crazier this week, a little more crying, a little bit more upset, but I think it's just, you know, I actually feel my hormones, which is great. Ooh, I feel nauseous. And the best thing this week that's happened that I am just so overjoyed is that I am feeling the baby move all the time now. The best when I lay down for sleep at night, I'll feel little patters of little feet and, or hands or whatever, and it's been so nice. Actually, Will got to feel the baby, which is unbelievable. Like, he's like, what are you doing? I'm like, I feel like the baby put his hand right there and it went right this little click kick and it's awesome. It is such a cool feeling. I just absolutely love it. I will miss it when it's over. It makes it so real all the time. And I'm just so excited to meet this little person. I'm so excited. I think that's it. Let's do the belly shot. All right, guys. Here's the belly shot at 17 weeks from the front. And here it is from the side. Yay. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. Please thumb this video up for us. We'd super appreciate it. And please subscribe. Hit that bell next to the subscribe button and you'll get notifications of our videos three days a week. Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye.